Governor under fire. First responders are outraged over a plan to take tens of millions dedicated to New Jersey firefighters to help balance the state's budget. Welcome back at 530. Governor Phil Murphy is defending his plan to drain a firefighter's fund. But critics say it's indefensible. Eyewitness News reporter Cleve Bryan is live in Vineland with the story. Cleve? Well, I spoke to a violent firefighter who is an officer with the State Firefighters Union. He says that the relief fund is doing what it's supposed to. It's there to help families in need, and it's growing in case of a rainy day. And that doesn't mean that the governor should dip into it for his own agenda. It seems like now we're being penalized for doing the right thing. Since the 1880s, New Jersey firefighters have been able to get a little extra help when times are tough through a dedicated relief fund. Firefighters are always there to help others and this fund is intended to help them in a time of need. The money comes from a 2% tax levied on fire insurance policies written by out-of-state providers. State and local boards can help firefighters with as much as $16,000 to cover burial costs in the event of a death or give assistance if a current or retired firefighter's family suffers a financial hardship. A violent has a very active fund. This fund has saved both volunteer and paid firemen from losing their homes. Um, it's kept widows um, in a warm house in the winter. But a recent audit found that the fund takes in much more money than it doles out. Right now it has about a $245 million surplus. And that's caught the eye of New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy. Unbeknownst to the firefighters union, the governor's proposed budget for next year diverts about $33 million from the relief fund to New Jersey's general fund to help fill budget gaps. This has happened before where other administrations have looked at this money as a, as a quick money grab and um, we're just not going to allow that. Monday, Murphy defended the proposal to divert the firemen's funds. But folks need to understand this uh, fund was, was, uh, has a fund balance six times the amount that it needs. But firefighters say why should they be penalized for being careful how they spend? God forbid there's another 9-11 or Superstorm Sandy disaster when they might need the money. Anything could happen, there could be a, a big disaster, and that's when we're going to have to dip into this money. Of course, the, far, uh, the budget process is far from over, and both the Firefighters Union and the governor expressed a willingness to come to the table and discuss this further. We're live in Vineland. Cleve Bryan, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Cleve, thank you for that.